Demokrat, Demokrat na nandito sa Pilipinas sa pagpapanalo ni U.S. President Barack Obama. Si Pangulong Noy Noy Aquino agad nagpaabot ng pagbati kay Obama. May news to go si Ivan Mayrina. Hiyawan kapag si U.S. President Barack Obama ang lumalamang. Tahimik naman kapag ang Republican na si Mitt Romney ang nakakaungos. Bawat update mula sa U.S. news agencies talaga namang tinututukan ng mga miyembro ng Democrats Abroad Philippines. I was saying we better get ready because it's going to be over soon. And then suddenly, Ohio started to tighten up. Uh, he, his lead in Ohio shrunk. And uh, then I started getting nervous. <laughs> Nang tiyak na ang panalo ni Obama, doon na sila nagdiwa. I went to Nevada and I spent four days walking the streets, knocking on doors. I would say, you know, I've come 8,000 miles to ask you to vote for Obama and the Democrats. Can you support us? Now, these were pre-selected, okay? We were told, don't, we're not here to persuade people. It's too late for that. So they had selected likely voters. And almost all of them said, yes, I can. Marami sa mga miyembro ng grupo ilang dekada na rito sa Pilipinas. Americans pay taxes whether we live in the U.S. or overseas. And I think that it shows that your vote can make a difference. We're affected by foreign policy and how the places we work perceive the United States. Um, I think we're also affected by tax policy. I plan on sending my children to school in the United States, so by education policy. Um, also by economic policies because I plan to go back. Ang fill-in na si Ricky Sobrevinas, tiniyak na nakaboto sa pamamagitan ng absentee ballot bago nagbakasyon sa Pilipinas. It was a momentous event for for America, for the choices that uh, uh, it made, and also great for the Filipinos. It's the Obama administration that has always considered minorities as part of, of its coalition. Habang binabantayan ang resulta ng eleksyon, nagsagawa naman ng mock election sa isang mall ang U.S. Embassy. Ang resulta, panalo sa mock election si Obama. Inanunsyo ang CNN projection sa totoong eleksyon, panalo si Obama sa ikalawang termino. Ang magkakabigan, it appears that President Obama has won re-election and we, we have a decision. And it's been a great, great victory for democracy. Pero ayon kay U.S. Ambassador Harry Thomas Jr., isang bagay na nangyari na sa Pilipinas ang hindi pa nagagawa sa eleksyon sa Amerika. We need to also emulate the Philippines and have a woman president. Ang anak ng kauna-unahang babaeng presidente ng Pilipinas, nagpadala na ng liham ng pagbati kay Obama. Kumpiyansa raw si Pangulong Noynoy Aquino na may pagpapatuloy ni Obama sa ikalawan niyang termino ang pagpapaunlad sa Amerika. Determinado raw ang administrasyong Aquino na higit pang pagtibay ng kooperasyon ng Pilipinas at Amerika. Ivan Meirina, GMA News.